Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Hey guys, today is stop. Not right now. Today is sorry about that. That's life. You guys know I have my puppies. Today is Tablescape Tuesday, guys. So, um, I want to do like a wild bee tablescape. Um, uh, I don't think I had ever since I started my YouTube channel, I have done a bee tablescape. So, um, usually B is yellow and black or black and yellow or with some pops of color. I'm going to try to use this much, um, color to the to the table like you know black and white but guys this is an open collaboration hosted by the grace life di white home decor amethyst adventures guys so for anybody who wants to join can join us hold on guys you know it's funny because as soon as i turn on the camera they start acting up they were laying down all right, guys, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to take out my, my lace uh, table uh, cloth. Look at this. I have to um, clean my table, so I'm going to do that, and then I'm going to bring you guys back. All right, guys, with this, I will be using a white table runner. Simple. Guys, I will link the the host channel in my description box below so you guys can go and check them out. And guys, check out Anna's community tab. She posts her calendar. Guys, we have the tear tray coming up, cozy corner coming up, and those are all open collaboration, guys. I mean, it just participate and, you know, it's just helping it grow, guys. Meet some new people, meet some new content creators, and that's how you grow. And I want to thank Anna because um, since I started collaborating with her, I picked up 41 subscribers, guys. And that's just by collaborating with her, you know? And be consistent, and yeah. So I want to thank Anna for all the help that she does and everything that she put together for us. Guys, so I'm going to, I think it's on the center, right? See, I can never measure it right. All right, guys, so I want to get this right on the center. I think that's on the center. Okay, I got the... Placemats from Dollar Tree, which they're kind of cute. That's why I, you know, um, you see the little beads and stuff in there. So, and guys, I'm doing a table for two. So, yep, a table for two. Um, Guys, if I would have black charger, I would love that, but I don't have any. So I'm going to use um, gold chargers with simple white plates. I will repeat the same thing on the other side. See, I'm the type of person that I know they sell on the Dollar Tree, the, the salad plate and the dinner plate. I don't like picking up both because to me, I don't know. To me, it's like, it makes sense seem like, I don't know. I don't, I don't like it. That's just my opinion. But to each their own. So here in the center, I'm going to be putting this round that I DIY a while back. Guys, I know you guys are far away, but I will bring you guys closer. I want to put them separate because the flower originally is going to go in the center, and I don't want to have any accidents with my candles. All right. Um, where am I going to put it? I picked up the salad plate from the Dollar Tree. Yeah, guys, I picked up 
This olive branch from the Dollar Tree. Wish they are so cute. Here you go. It says, you are the big queen? Hmm. King? K-N-E-E-N? Oh, whatever. Anyway. I pick those up. So, we place those there. You see, I think that looks very nice to me. Um... I have Vantage glass from High C, company High C. These are very old glasses. These glasses came out in the 1940s, 1950s. So I have this with the little flowers. So it goes perfect with the um, set. So I'm using those. And then. <coughs> To keep it with the black and clean sums, I'm going to use my champagne flute. Just to keep it. All right, and with that, I'm using double napkins with my Double napkin. Eh, no, I don't like that. I don't want to cover the plate either, so I think I will just place them here on this side. Well, the table is big for two, so we could just spread things around. It also makes the table look fuller. So with that, I'm using simple utensils. So guys, today, finally, our temperature went above 70 and not raining. So I went out for a long walk this morning. It was beautiful. All right, guys. So, so far, how did you guys liking that? So I hope you guys are liking that so far. All right. Um, I actually, uh, since it's a big theme table, I DIY some things. I will be linking the video either here or here so you guys can go and check it out. How I turn trash to treasure, guys. I think they turned out very nice. Um, let me put my candelabras. And I'm using my DIY candles from the Dollar Tree and the center to keep the theme of black and gold. I mean, it could have been yellow, but I don't have uh, yellow candles, so black and gold. And the other two are white. So I think that's nice. And guys, you know what's my signature on my table stage? You guys know I need to bring in my teapot for tea. So, um, let's see. You guys know that I love elevating my teapot, so let me get ready to do that. I put my stand right here. It's simple, guys. This is a margarita glass. See it? All you have to do is find something that's wide enough. I DIY this for that same reason. So you just place that there. I also gotta go get my other stand that I DIY a while back 
because I'm going to be putting some cake on top of it. Well, guys, I changed my mind about the cake, but I'm going to be having a strawberries and tea right after I finish. Yep, that's what we're going to do. So I have some strawberries. Then we're going to have some tea and strawberries. So let me bring my cream, my milk, because I don't use cream for my tea. Sometimes I use milk, sometimes I don't. So there it goes. So I don't think I'm missing anything. Just besides my Cups. I will keep this over here in this grouping because I'm going to be, uh, my grandson is coming, so I don't know if he's, you know, he doesn't drink tea. He likes his hot cocoa and stuff, so that's what we're going to have. So I have half cocoa and I have my tea. So guys, what else? Am I missing anything? Um, I can't think. Well, let me place my DIYs that I did for how I created my DIYs. And like I say, I would link the video so you guys can go and check it out. Now, let's bring my flower arrangement. I see my flower arrangement in uh, different type of um, flower, you know, a vase. So, I did some flowers with the bees and I also got the little, tiny little flowers. So I think that's nice. I like it. What do you guys think? Let me bring it close, guys. I like it, guys. I think it turned out very nice. So guys, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to close the, my shades, turn off the light, light up the candles for you guys. Look at my dog, my service dog. He won't leave my side. And I'm turning on the candles for you guys and show you what it looks like. So guys, let's do that. All right, guys, this is what my table looks like. That's with the lights off and my shades closed. I hope you guys like what I put together for you. I will show you this side and then I will take you to the other side. There is my DIY cross that I did for the video yesterday, my little bee decor. Here's my honey, honeycomb, I think it's called. My honeycomb, I think it turned out very nice. If I add it also to the flower arrangement, uh, those pigs. Th these flowers are from Michael's, Except the greenery that hangs is from the Dollar Tree and this big flower over here is from Walmart. Guys, I added the greenery because I wanted the flower arrangement to look like a wild bunch of flowers that you go pick in the, you know, when you go out. And then here is my teapot 
what I'm going to be having after I finish my video, of course. And then from this side, there is my other DIY that I created. And then my place setting. And there is my sign that says be kind. So guys, let me come over here, show you from the top one more time. Let's turn on the light and show you one more time. Let me come over here, guys, and leave it like I always say. Be kind to one another. Don't forget to smile overall. Stay safe, stay healthy. And remember, guys, God loves you. And Debbie also loves you, too. It will be into the next one. Bye-bye, guys.